Welcome to History Tales, the channel that tells history. In this video, we will summarize the Greek mythological tradition, which constitutes a vast corpus of tales and reveals the ancient cosmology and rich mythology of the gods and heroes of ancient Greece. These myths passed down through generations represent a fundamental element of the religious and artistic culture of the ancient Greeks. The Greek pantheon, composed of a hierarchy of deities who embody natural forces and aspects of nature, constitutes the central nucleus of this tradition. The Olympian deities, led by Zeus, dominate this pantheon, while the heroes, such as Heracles and Odysseus, represent human courage and virtue. The transmission of myths occurred mainly through oral tradition, with poetic tales and epic compositions passed down from generation to generation. However, they have come down to us mainly through literary works, including the famous epic poems of the Iliad and the Odyssey attributed to Homer. Works such as Theogony and the works and days of Hesiod, along with the Homeric hymns and fragments of the epic cycle poems, offer a broader perspective on Greek mythology, covering topics ranging from the creation of the world to the chronology of the gods and human ages. The impact of Greek mythology extends beyond literature, influencing art and crafts as well. Ancient vases and plates feature geometric designs depicting mythological scenes, while later artworks continue to depict mythical episodes, providing a visual complement to literary texts. Greek mythology has left an indelible imprint on Western culture, influencing the arts, literature, and even philosophical thought. His legacy remains vital to this day, continuing to be studied and celebrated as one of the greatest and most fascinating storytelling traditions in human history. In Greek mythology, mythos and tio and awent logos are two important ideas that help understand how the ancient Greeks saw the world. Mythos refers to traditional stories and tales, while wanted logos concerns reason and logical thinking. These two ideas coexisted and influenced each other, contributing to the overall worldview and Greek philosophy. The term mythos comes from ancient Greek and evokes the idea of a traditional narrative, often of a mythical or legendary nature that has been passed down orally for generations. These narratives are imbued with symbols, allegories, and profound meanings that go beyond the mere chronicle of events. In Greek myths, the mythos is the vehicle through which human beliefs, values, experiences, and understanding of the divine are conveyed. They tell stories of gods and demigods, heroes and fantastic creatures, offering mythological explanations for natural phenomena, historical events, and aspects of the human condition. The mythos, therefore, represents a form of profound knowledge, a sort of ancestral wisdom that shaped Greek culture and identity. On the other end of the conceptual spectrum, we find the term logos, which refers to rationality, logical discourse, and the search for truth through reason. In Greek culture, the logos model was associated with philosophy, rhetoric, science, and logic, representing the systematic and rational pursuit of knowledge. In contrast to the mythos, the logos relied on critical analysis, empirical observation, and rational argumentation to understand the world and its laws. This rational approach to knowledge led to the birth of Greek philosophy and profoundly influenced the development of Western thought. The duality between their mythos and logos reflects the fundamental tension in ancient Greek culture between mythological explanation of the world and philosophical rationalization. While the mythos offered a poetic and symbolic interpretation of reality, the Logos aspired to a rational and systematic understanding of the cosmos and human existence. This tension permeated every aspect of Greek life and thought, influencing religion, philosophy, literature, and even politics. However, rather than being mutually exclusive, Mythos and Logos often complemented each other, providing two complementary perspectives on truth and knowledge. The evolution of the concepts of mythos and logos in the context of Greek culture reflects historical, social, and intellectual transformations across the ages. While the Montan mythos retained its centrality in religion, art, and literature, the logos gave rise to philosophy, science, and the search for rational truth. However, both concepts have continued to coexist and interact, 
enriching human understanding of reality and existence. In Greek mythology, the muses play a vital role as sources of inspiration for poets, artists, and musicians. These deities, nine sister daughters of Zeus and Namasinu, personify the arts and sciences, guiding and inspiring humans in their creations. The sacredness of museum inspiration gives a mythological narratives a divine character, transforming the works of men into manifestations of the eternal and sublime. The muses, with their different spheres of influence, were concerned with a wide range of artistic and scientific disciplines, from literary arts to music, from dance to history. Each muse was associated with a particular creative field, offering its guidance and inspiration to artists dedicated to that discipline. For example, Calliope was the muse of epic, while Melpomene was the muse of tragedy. The relationship between the poets and the muses represented a bridge between humanity and the divine as artists sought their divine inspiration to create works that could uplift the soul and communicate universal truths. Poets and artists who invoked the muses were considered blessed as they received the gift of divine inspiration, which transformed their creations into works of beauty and profound meaning. The sacredness of museum inspiration amplified the meaning and symbolic significance of mythological narratives, giving them a spiritual and aesthetic dimension that made them more than simple tales. Works created under the aegis of the muses were considered imbued with a divine quality, which elevated them above the earthly world and connected them to the realm of the gods. The mythical stories that resulted from museum inspiration reflected not only the creative flair of the artists, but also humanity's profound wisdom and understanding of life, death, love, war, and other universal themes. The muses acted as mediums between gods and men, transmitting knowledge and truth through their inspirations. The connections between the poets and the muses fostered a sense of community and cultural continuity, as the artists saw themselves as part of a divinely inspired tradition that extended across generations. This sense of spiritual and aesthetic continuity was fundamental to the creation and preservation of Greek culture, as it ensured the transmission of human knowledge and experiences through works of art and literature. Greek mythology is renowned for the richness of its characters and deities, each of which embodies unique aspects of ancient Greek culture and collective psyche. From the assembly of the omnipotent Olympian gods to legendary heroes such as Heracles and Ulysses, the Greek mythological pantheon is imbued with cultural and symbolic meanings that reflect the collective imagination of an entire civilization. At the pinnacle of the Greek mythological pantheon resided the Olympian gods, led by the king of the gods, Zeus. Each god and goddess possessed unique characteristics and personified specific aspects of human nature and the universe. For example, Athena represented wisdom and strategy, Apollo represented beauty and music, and Ares represented war and violence. Their complex interactions and divine intrigues formed the core of mythological narratives reflecting the power dynamics and tensions within human society. Alongside the gods, Greek mythology is populated by a vast assortment of legendary heroes, each with epic stories and breathtaking adventures. Heracles, the most famous of them, was known for his 12 labors and his superhuman strength, which embodied the ideal of the Greek hero. Ulysses, protagonist of the Odyssey, represented cunning and wisdom navigating through pitfalls and dangers to return to his homeland, Ithaca. These heroes embodied values such as courage, perseverance, and ingenuity, offering role models and aspirations for the ancient Greeks. Each character and deity of Greek mythology carried with them a cultural and symbolic meaning that reflected the concerns, aspirations, and fears of Greek society. Their stories served as a conduit to convey moral values, explain natural phenomena, and celebrate heroism and virtue. For example, the myth of Perseus and Medusa could be interpreted as a metaphor for victory over fear and darkness, while the myth of Demeter and Persephone could reflect the cycles of nature and agriculture. The evolution of myths across eras and regions offered an interesting window into the collective psyche of ancient Greece, showing how society's beliefs, values, and aspirations changed over time. For example, the stories of the Mycenaean heroes differed from those of the heroes of the classical age, reflecting the different needs and priorities of the historical eras. 
Furthermore, regional variations in the myths highlighted the cultural differences and external influences that shaped Greek mythology over the centuries. The historical analysis of the myths in Greek mythology offers a fascinating overview of the conceptions of the world and divinity in ancient Greece, providing a key to understanding the culture and history of the time. Across the different mythological eras, ranging from the age of gods to the age of heroes, Greco-Roman myths span a vast spectrum of themes and narratives, offering a wide range of perspectives on the human condition and the relationships between gods and the men. The Age of the Gods represents the primordial period of Greek mythology, characterized by cosmogony and the creation of the universe. This period features narratives about the birth of primordial gods, such as Gaia, the earth, and Uranus, the sky, as well as the succession of deities such as Cronus and Zeus. Greek mythology offers various views on the creation and governance of the universe, reflecting the conceptions of the world and divinity in ancient Greece. Within the Age of the Gods, the mythology of the Olympian gods develops, dominating Mount Olympus and ruling over specific aspects of the universe. Zeus, as king of the gods, symbolizes authority and power, while deities such as Athena, Apollo, Artemis, and Ares personify specific aspects of human life and nature. The stories of the Olympian gods reflect the relationships within the pantheon and relationships with humans illustrating the power dynamics and moral challenges faced by the gods. The Age of Heroes represents an intermediate period between gods and men, characterized by the deeds of demigods and human heroes, such as Heracles, Odysseus, Theseus, and Achilles. These heroes face trials, adventures, and epic conflicts, embodying virtues such as courage, wisdom, and loyalty. Their deeds are often intertwined with those of the gods, showing the interaction between the divine and the human, and offering examples of the heroism and virtue that inspired the ancient Greeks. Greek myths reflect ancient Greek conceptions of the world and divinity, offering profound insight into society's beliefs, values, and aspirations. These narratives not only explain the origin of the cosmos and natural phenomena, but also provided models of behavior and moral aspirations for the ancient Greeks. Through myths, the ancient Greeks explored their relationships with the divine, nature, and humanity, seeking meaning and understanding in the world around them. The family tree of Olympian deities in Greek mythology traces an intricate web of relationships between the gods, revealing complex family dynamics and divine conflicts that permeate the entire pantheon. This family tree offers an important key to understanding the relationships between the different deities and their facets in Greek mythology. At the center of the family tree of the Olympian gods stands Zeus, king of the gods and lord of the sky. Zeus is the son of Cronus and Rhea and brother of deities such as Poseidon, Hades, Demeter, Athena, Apollo, and Artemis. Through his marriage to Hera, Zeus becomes the father of Ares, Hephaestus, Hebe, and Alithia. Zeus's relationships with other deities and mortals, as well as his numerous adventures and loves, add further facets to the family tree, creating an intricate web of divine kinship. In addition to direct descent from Zeus, the Olympian deities are related to each other through various family relationships. For example, Apollo and Artemis are the children of Zeus and Leto, while Hermes is the son of Zeus and Maia. Dionysus is the son of Zeus and Semele, while Aphrodite has different origins, having been born from the sperm of Uranus that fell into the sea. These relationships reveal intrinsic bonds between the gods, often intertwined through marriage, affinity, and descent. Family dynamics among the Olympian gods are often marked by conflict and tension, reflecting universal themes of jealousy, pride, and power. For example, the tumultuous relationship between Zeus and Hera is characterized by jealousy and betrayal, while the power struggles between Zeus and his brothers, such as Hades and Poseidon, show the rivalries within the pantheon. Even the relationships between the gods and their mortal children, as in the case of Zeus and Perseus or Apollo and Hermes, can be complex and fraught with tension. The family tree of the Olympian gods is not only a record of divine relationships, but also has deep symbolic and cultural meaning in Greek mythology. These relationships reflect the ideals and dynamics of human society, offering a lens through which to explore themes of family, kinship, and destiny. 
Furthermore, the family tree provides a mythological foundation for understanding the hierarchy and structure of the pantheon, as well as explaining the conflicts and alliances between the gods. Greek mythology is filled with a wide range of deities and other legendary figures that contribute to the complexity and beauty of the mythological pantheon. These deities and mythological creatures play distinct roles within Greek cultural tradition, offering a wide range of symbolic and cultural meanings that shaped the worldview of the ancient Greeks. At the center of Greek mythology are the Olympian gods, led by Zeus, the king of the gods. Each Olympian god and goddess has a specific role in the universe, representing different aspects of human nature and the natural world. For example, Athena is the goddess of wisdom and just war. Apollo is the god of light and the arts, and Dionysus is the god of wine and ecstasy. These deities embody virtues, vices, and aspects of human life, providing a model of behavior and a moral point of reference for the ancient Greeks. In addition to the gods, Greek mythology is populated by a variety of mythological creatures, some of which are friendly and beneficial, while others are evil and dangerous. Among the best-known mythological creatures are the centaurs, half-man and half-horse beings, mermaids, fascinating-looking sea creatures who lure sailors to ruin, and Cerberus, the ferocious three-headed dog who guards the entrance to the underworld. These creatures embody natural forces, human fears, and abstract concepts, adding depth and fascination to Greek mythology. In addition to gods and mythological creatures, Greek mythology is populated by demigods and legendary heroes, figures who are half divine and half mortal. Heracles, son of Zeus, is perhaps the most famous demigod, known for his 12 labors and his superhuman strength. Ulysses, protagonist of the Odyssey, is another legendary hero, famous for his cunning and intelligence. These demigods and heroes embody the Greek ideal of heroic virtue and embody struggle, sacrifice, and perseverance. Each deity and mythological figure in Greek mythology carries with it a cultural and symbolic meaning that reflects the beliefs, values, and aspirations of the ancient Greeks. The stories of deities and mythological creatures not only explain natural and human phenomena, but also provided a narrative frame through which the ancient Greeks explored their relationship with the divine, nature, and the surrounding world. These mythological figures embody virtues, vices, and aspects of human life, providing a model of behavior and a moral reference point for the ancient Greeks. Greco-Roman myths constitute a fundamental pillar in the formation of Greek culture and identity, permeating every aspect of ancient society and profoundly influencing philosophy, art, and literature. These mythical narratives were not simply fantastic tales, but served as a means through which the ancient Greeks explored the mysteries of the universe, human nature, and the divine, providing a narrative frame for understanding the world around them. Greco-Roman myths were an integral part of the education and training of young people in ancient Greece. Through these stories, the ancient Greeks learned not only the history and deeds of the gods and heroes, but also the moral and social values that underpinned these narratives. The myths offered models of behavior and virtue to follow, encouraging loyalty, courage, justice, and wisdom. Greco-Roman myths had a significant impact on ancient Greek philosophy providing insights into fundamental questions regarding human existence and the nature of the universe. The works of philosophers such as Plato and Aristotle often refer to myths as metaphors or analogies to explore complex philosophical concepts such as justice, truth, and virtue. Myths offered fertile ground for philosophical speculation, serving as a starting point for deepening understanding of the world. Greco-Roman myths have inspired countless works of art and literature over the centuries, contributing to the richness and diversity of Western cultural heritage. From Homer's epics, such as the Iliad and the Odyssey, to the tragedies of Aeschylus, Sophocles, and Euripides, to paintings and sculptures depicting mythological deities and heroes, Greco-Roman myths have provided a wide range of themes and motifs for artistic and creative expression. The rational and syncretistic interpretation of the myths reflects the cultural and religious transformations that have characterized the Greco-Roman world through the centuries. With the advance of Hellenistic and Roman philosophy and rationality, 
myths were often reinterpreted in an allegorical or symbolic key, partially losing their literal meaning, but maintaining their cultural and spiritual relevance. At the same time, religious syncretism led to a fusion and adaptation of myths and beliefs from different cultures, enriching the mythological and spiritual panorama of antiquity. Modern theories on the origin and function of myths offer a fascinating perspective of analysis on the mythological legacy, deepening the connections between myth and various fields such as psychology, society, and religion. These modern interpretations reveal the continuing relevance and complexity of Greco-Roman myths in the contemporary context, showing how such narratives are not simply relics of the past, but still possess an evocative power and depth of meaning that can be explored in new and innovative ways. The impact of Greek myths in modern media is testimony to the pervasiveness and ongoing relevance of these ancient narratives in contemporary culture. The stories of the gods, heroes, and mythological creatures of ancient Greece continue to exert a significant influence on a wide range of forms of artistic expression and entertainment, from the film and television industries to literature, video games, and beyond. This persistent presence of Greek myths in modern media is a reflection of their universality and their ability to connect with the deepest and most universal aspects of human experience. Greek myths have become an inexhaustible source of inspiration for numerous films and television series. Productions such as Troy, 300, Clash of the Titans, and Wonder Woman are just a few examples of how the stories of Greek gods and heroes are adapted for the big and small screen capturing the imagination of millions of viewers around the world. These works often blend elements of action, adventure, drama, and fantasy, bringing Greek myths to a new generation of viewers in an accessible and engaging format. Greek myths continue to inspire writers of every literary genre, from historical fiction to fantasy and contemporary fiction. Works such as The Metamorphoses by Ovid, the Greek tragedies by Aeschylus, Sophocles, and Euripides, and the Odyssey by Homer are just some of the literary works that have shaped Western literary narrative and creativity. Additionally, modern authors like Rick Reardon with the Percy Jackson series have brought Greek myths into a new light, introducing them to young audiences through modern, accessible storytelling. Even in the context of video games and comics, Greek myths find space to express themselves, Video games like God of War take players on a journey through Greek mythology, putting them in the shoes of heroes and demigods as they face the challenges and dangers of ancient Greece. In the world of comics, characters like Wonder Woman and Hercules continue to embody the heroic virtues and moral struggles of mythological heroes, keeping the legacy of Greek myths alive in modern media. Greek myths have also inspired musical artists, painters, sculptors, and more, helping to shape contemporary visual and sonic culture. Works of art, such as paintings and sculptures, often depict mythological scenes and Greek deities, while classical and contemporary music can reference Greek myths in its lyrics and composition, creating a bridge between the past and the present through music. The influence of Greek myths on Western art and literature through the ages stands as an important testament to the enduring appeal and universal significance of these ancient narratives. Since ancient times, Greek myths have been an inexhaustible source of inspiration for artists and writers of every era, shaping narrative and creativity in multiple forms of expression. In Western art, Greek myths have been an inexhaustible source of inspiration for painters, sculptors, and artists of all kinds. From the time of painted Attic vases, which depicted mythological scenes in Greek deities, to the Renaissance works of artists such as Michelangelo and Raphael, who were inspired by the deeds of the heroes and gods of ancient Greece, Greek myths have constantly fueled creativity artistic. Even in modern and contemporary art, Greek myths continue to be a source of inspiration, transforming mythological stories and characters into emblematic works of art that reflect humanity's values, conflicts, and aspirations. In Western literature, Greek myths have been a constant presence since classical antiquity. Epic works such as Homer's Iliad and Odyssey, which chronicle the exploits of Greek heroes during the Trojan War and their adventurous journey across the Mediterranean, have shaped epic narrative and story structure for centuries. The tragedies of Aeschylus, Sophocles, 
and Euripides with their powerful depictions of human passions and moral conflicts establish the canons of Western dramatic theater. Even in modern literature, Greek myths continue to exert a significant influence, with authors such as James Joyce, William Faulkner, and Margaret Atwood referencing Greek myths in their works, creating connections between the past and present through literary narrative. Greek myths have also inspired musical composers, poets, and other creative artists, influencing musical production, poetry, and other forms of artistic expression. Musical works such as Franz Liszt's Four Greek Ballads and Beethoven's Raoul Prometheus reflect musical artists' interest in Greek mythological stories and characters, transforming them into evocative musical compositions that capture the listener's imagination. In this video, we have just scratched the surface of a vast and fascinating universe of myths and legends that make up Greek mythology. We've touched on some of the most iconic characters, epic tales, and foundational themes that permeate this rich cultural tradition. In future videos, we'll dive even deeper, examining in greater detail the stories of the gods and heroes, the creation of the world, and much more. If you like this video, put a like and subscribe to the channel, activating notifications, so as to always be updated on the next contents of History Tales, the channel that tells the story. See you next time.